air signs it's nicola so let's see what messages we have this is for the weekend of february the 2nd through february the 4th 2019 what messages do we have for taurus capricorn virgo sun moon rising and venus what guidance do we have for taurus capricorn virgo sun moon rising and venus guidance for taurus capricorn virgo sun moon rising and venus what guidance or messages do we have for taurus capricorn virgo Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. February the 2nd to February the 4th, 2019. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. February the 2nd to February the 4th, 2019. Let's see what we got. Eight of Wands. Energy moving forward. There's some movement forward. It's a lot of energy here. Ooh, Capricorn moving forward, front and center. Cappies, y'all here. Y'all moving forward. Energy's moving forward. Things are moving forward around you. Ooh, a shift. There's a shift. There's a shift in a relationship. Someone's making a decision. Someone could be making a decision to move toward love. Um, I'm not sure if it's you, though. <laughs> Queen of Swords here. Decisions being made. Libra energy here. Um, someone's weighing some options about a relationship. Wanting to move forward. Justice here. Deciding what's right for you. And I'm not, and I said for you for a reason, because this is about you. This is deciding what is right for you. A lot of you guys have had an ego or a fear in moving forward in your life, whether it's moving forward into something, out of something, whatever the case may be, there has been a fear. There has been a blockage. You have blocked yourself from moving forward. Y'all, I'm so sorry to keep that dread out of my face. Um, but now there's a decision being made and the decision leads to forward movement. Justice card here. There could be a lot going on as well. Um, so this is the end of a, a cycle. Knight of Swords moving forward. There are some disappointments. You are disappointed because something that you didn't see. Um, Queen of Swords, a decision that you were unaware of. Someone was weighing options against you. Okay, then. You may be needing to see something from a different perspective as well because this particular Justice card has, she's blindfolded. So this may have came out of nowhere especially with this tower this may have been a shock this may have been like whoa what the fuck um it leads to ace of cups it leads to forward movement it leads to a new opportunity some of you guys have already had the opportunity but now it may be moving forward so whatever shock this is may be putting something in motion tower card here this is a shift a shift in a relationship a new opportunity um someone may a new opportunity that has been long coming put it like that so for some of you guys, I'm going to be real with you. The new opportunity may come after something has ended here. After some disappointments have been had within the situation. Um, realizing what it is that you want in a relationship. So someone is very clear about what they want in a relationship. You may not see it. Because if, if there's someone that's being clear about what they want in a relationship, you may not have seen it. You see it now because Tower is in the past. So the, the realization is already evident. You may not have seen a decision that was being pondered. But once the decision was made, you see. Blindfold is off. Or you may still not see it because some of y'all still may be blindfolded trying to weigh options within yourself. Um, but somebody here realizes what they want within a relationship and may be trying to put the gears in motion, trying to put things in motion to move toward it. Ace of Cups here. New opportunity here. Yeah, so I'm trying to tell you. Death card here, Eight of Cups. Someone is transforming a situation by walking away. Walking away from third party, walking away from uh, multiple people. Maybe even walking away going toward a third party because Page of Wands, Three of Cups. That's someone new. That's someone that has given you some good news. Capricorn energy. So either you're walking away toward someone, uh, someone's walking away from you. You're dealing with the Capricorn. They may be walking away from you. They may be walking away from a situation. They may be going through some type of emo emotional growth. Aye. Uh -uh. So someone realizes that they needed to set boundaries. So a Capricorn realizes that they needed to set boundaries to a situation. Now, Capricorn, if this is you, you realize that you need to set boundaries to a situation. You needed to do what was right. Some of you guys, this is about a toxic relationship, a karmic relationship that is balancing out ending 
moving forward. Um, transformation happened because someone set their sets higher. They want something different. So they're walking away from the illusions of a relationship. Check the air sign read over. I, I, check the air sign read out. The worst is over. So even within this situation, there's a shift in perspective. Someone knows now what they need to do. So the Queen of Swords and the Justice card, this could be a Libra weighing some options. A Libra female weighing some options. Having clarity about what it is she wants walking away from a earth sign. Capricorn is what I'm pulling. It could be any earth sign though. The 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 devil here, because of what I'm seeing, the devil here could be the ego, could be the fear, could be the pride, whatever it is for you, whatever the ego is for you, this could be that. Because there is a shift in perspective here and there's a new opportunity to move forward, but someone may have been procrastinating because of some responsibilities. That is done, ended over. Ace of Cups, new opportunity because someone walked away. Ten of Pentacles, this is about wealth. Ooh. Ooh. Someone's expecting that something will change because they made a decision. So a relationship is over. A household situation is over that may have been at a lack. Someone is making plans to go towards something that is wealth for them. Whether this is another relationship, whether this is a person, whether this is a job, whatever this is, someone's moving towards something that is wealthy for them. This is you, earth sign. You know something that you know something will bring wealth to you. So you're really finding the courage to complete this cycle and move forward because you understand ten of swords that thing will that things will get better. You understand that the worst is motherfucking over. Okay? Queen of Swords here. Why is this Queen of Swords here? Queen of Swords here. Why is this Queen of Swords here? Why is this Queen of Swords here? Emperor, devil, mm -hmm. Capricorn, gaining control, maybe feeling heartbroken, but you may be making a decision to manifest what it is that you've been having. Pa you've been having patience with something. Someone may also be setting some boundaries um, to a toxic relationship, making decisions. You could be cutting that now. Women, you could be cut. If this is a woman, she's cutting away a Capricorn. Gaining her boundaries, gaining boundaries to a situation, having patience, bringing something else to into fruition. There may be some anxiety, but this is 10 swords. They're expecting that something will get better after a severance. Okay. Check out the air signs read. If this is a male, you're cutting away a female that has been, that has caused some heartbreak, some betrayals. You're moving forward, um, really setting some boundaries to some codependencies here, especially money codependencies, having patience with um, yourself. There may be some cruelty as well from both parts because this is an ending. Um, but I don't know if, because there's not a lot of communication. So even though this is an ending, I don't see a lot of communication. So I don't even know if everyone knows about this yet because there's not a lot of communication here, but there is a damn sure decision that's been made. Um, someone's very much trying to figure out how to speak their truths. What messages do we have for my earth signs? Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Expect the miracle. It says, have faith that your prayers have been heard and are being answered. Some of you guys need to be receptive. receptive. Okay, so this person may be trying to express to you what they feel, but you may not be open to receiving it because you're feeling drained by some situation, even by this situation. Um, be receptive to receiving that energy into intuition so that you can help others as well. This is all I got, Earth Signs. Peace.